A healthy environment means healthy people that live here. And it's always been that way and always will be. We really got to think about future generations, our babies, our grandchildren. We could start bringing back that biodiversity and really help all the ungulates, the bear, the wolves, everything. We just need the willingness to really identify what we have and then make those changes. We on Vancouver Island love our wildlife. So we love our cougars, our bears, our wolves, our salmon, our birds. But we know that from this huge biodiversity crisis we have, the wildlife is losing their habitat, and importantly, they're losing the connections between the habitats. What we envision is a network of corridors from tip to tip of Vancouver Island, on the land and also in the waters. We also realized very early that it had to be indigenous land and based on the laws of indigenous peoples and also their cultural practices. So the first phase of our project is with 13 nations on the west coast of Vancouver Island. The initiative was born out of a regional gathering, looking at the fragmented landscape, wildlife being pushed to the peripheries of their habitat, and a disconnect with the land. There's been some incredible projects so far, working with mapping, youth working with elders. We can find not only sanctuaries for the animals, but also look at ways on how uh, Indigenous peoples can prosper. Through the Corridor Project, we want to seek the advice of our elders that still hold on to those teachings. What brings us together is a crisis when it comes to our relationship with animals and, and, and other species. We want the nations that are impacted to really grab the steering wheel. We're there to support so that when those nations decide to exercise their self-determination, and declare or otherwise designate IPCAs in their homelands, that we have those supports in place. This is our time. We decided to go to our membership and ask, what's important to us? What do we need to protect? We took our old village sites, our traveling routes, our trails, our harvesting areas. How do we protect this? To build these corridors up and down the island. We need to have all the nations working together 